today what we're going to show you is how to install our new light bar kit for the TSX ultra low temperature freezers. This is a new exciting option that we have that provides a visual indication of alarm conditions on the new TSX units. First step is I'm going to unlatch the lower door. I've got a little wedge here I'll just keep so that the door doesn't come back while I'm mounting the bar. I'm going to remove the light bar from the packaging. So you can see how it looks here. There's also a set of fasteners in here that I want to make sure that I have out and ready. The first step is I'm going to take off the cap. The reason I'm taking that cap off is so it, it eases the procedure of feeding this wire up through. Bring that through and up, and then I will replace the cap. Then I'm going to use the thumb screw, locate the thumb screw hole, and then slightly tighten that down. I'll need to just remove this filter locate the hole on this side, feed it up through, put the thumb screw on, tighten that down, replace the cup. And then the last step is to connect, I'm going to remove the covering cap and I'm going to plug in until we hear it snap. Okay, now that the light bar is installed and the unit's powered up, I'm gonna show you how to enable the lighting system. So it's simply a matter of going in on the display on the touch screen, you'll see what's the settings display. It looks like two little wheels. I'm gonna hit that. Then I'm gonna go to display and then I'll need to toggle down. You notice here, I'm not seeing anything about LED lights. I will toggle down until I find LED lights. Notice here from the factory, it's disabled. I'm going to enable the system. You'll also see here that we have green, orange, and red. And I can turn any of those on. You would want to have all of them on. And we'll demonstrate how that works. If I hit save, you notice the green light has now come on. I'll save my settings. So the green light's on under normal conditions with no issues and no alarms. If I open the door, the unit will flash orange. So that's an indication that the door is open. If there's any other alarm condition, a minor alarm condition, it will light up orange. If there's an acute alarm condition, it will light up red. So notice I'll close the door and it will go back to green. The light bar accessory indicates visually what's going on with the unit. If the light bar is green, that means there's no system operating issue. So from a distance, you can see everything's okay. If, as we illustrated, we have a door opening, it will flash orange, and there are a number of other conditions that will create an orange light. Typically, those are conditions that indicate a potential future cargo risk, but not an immediate cargo risk. And these are things like failure to reach set point, maybe a compressor temperature that's getting too warm, could be an ambient temperature as well issue. Any of these will indicate an orange condition, and that means that at some point attention should be paid to the unit. Finally, if the unit is indicating a red light, that is an indication of immediate cargo risk and immediate attention needs to be paid. So it's an acute situation. And that would be things such as the door is left open and not closed for a period of time, a power failure, a compressor type failure. Any of those that could put the cargo at risk and immediate attention is needed is where you will see a red light and red alarm.